हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर डिस्कसिंग दी क्वेश्चन बैंक ऑफ मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रोसेस वन ऑफ डीबा टू यूनिवर्सिटी डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग हियर फ्रॉम दैट क्वेश्चन बैंक वी हैव यूनिट वन विद अ फोर्टीन क्वेश्चंस लेट्स स्टार्ट यो आई हैव कलेक्ट द आंसर्स ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम यूनिट वन I am just going to turn page one by one. You may take screenshots or pause it and read it. C. Explain why casting is important manufacturing process. Here I have written three points about it. Then define pattern. State any four types of patterns. What is pattern? That definition I have write it. Here is types of pattern. explain it as you understand it then what are the difference between solidification of pure metals and metal alloys here is a pure metals and here is a metal alloys then next what are the function of core and what is core venting core function and core venting then define shrinkage then next question define shrinkage and porosity how can you tell whether cavities in casting are due to porosity or shrinkage it starts from here and ends here next question what is sprue what shape should a sprue have if a mold has no other choking means here i have what is the sprue but i didn't know the shape should that i didn't know that is parabola or uh, cylindrical next question what is the function of core prints then what are the major types of sand molds what are their characteristics types are green molding sand then oven dried or break sand then cold box mold and another one is no bake mold next question what do you understand from centrifugal casting here is explanation and here is a small diagram if you draw diagram there is a one mark more weightage for this question next what keeps the mold together in vacuum casting next what is the investment casting process capable of producing fine surfaces details on casting it starts from here and ends here then describe the permanent mold casting processes and discuss how it differs from the other casting processes discuss the process it simply starts from here and it's a diagram then compare it next question describe the various alloys commonly cast through pressure die casting next describe briefly the shell casting process using knit sketches state its advantages and disadvantages according to me this is the most lengthy question from this unit your processes are arranged then here is steps drawings and here is advantages and disadvantages